dear students nowadays we are reading about cyber safety and as you know it is very much important to know very much important to have a sound knowledge about the protection while you are online because online whenever you are online there are so many fraudster and fraudulent people are sitting to steal your information valuable information related to bank and other things as well your personal information can be stolen so it is quite essential to know how to protect ourselves and how to protect our data information and uh, mobile and uh, you know laptop and palm top and whatever the top this we have whatever the form of computer which we have we have to protect them so let's start so what is there which we are going to proper usage of password should be there if you want to save yourself if you want to protect yourself passwords are an important form of protection for you while you are online just mind it you can enter into an online account only if you know the correct password for opening it if anybody wants to open your information he wants to open your uh, you know you want to steal any information of yours from your email account then the person requires your email and password and when your password will be strong and nobody else will know it then definitely you are safe uh, otherwise you are not safe you are not protected since password gives entry to an online account it is impossible to keep it secure creating a secure passwords an important part of protecting you online a strong password what helps you a strong passwords helps to keep your personal information safe protect your emails files other content prevent someone from breaking into your account if your password is strong means a strong password means some special characters you have used just not the password should not be like this 1 2 3 4 5 Five, four, three, two, one. No, this is wrong. Some special characters should be used. So, password. It is not necessary that the password should be long. Password should be short. But the special characters must be used in your password while you are creating password for any of for any of your account. Then you have to use some special characters. Now, let us learn more about how our passwords may be cracked. and how to choose a good password this thing we are going to know about it how our password may be cracked there are few ways your account password can be compromised someone's out to get you some people desperately try to get access to your account this is the desperation of some people they are always and this this can't be you know nobody can save from himself or herself from such kind of people and these people are there in the in the world not only in india but also in the world these kind of people are found so we have to save if we want to protect ourselves then we have what we have to do they might be able to guess your email email password they might guess suppose uh, sometime it happens that uh, people often use uh, you know their uh, mobile number their uh, car number their you know uh, you know date of birth so they can guess so whenever if you are using such kind of things as your password then definitely you have to make some changes in them suppose your date of birth is 15 8 2030 suppose 2013 or 2000 suppose then 2000 you have to write down first and then month then year like this you can change and some other changes you can make simply you should not write down you should not create your password that Will be guessed by a fraudulent person over internet, and use password recovery option to access your other accounts. This is quite essential. You become a victim of brute force attack. These attacks work by systematically checking all possible paraphrases until the correct one is found. They uh, they often try to this this and this and this. This may be there. This may be there. This may be there. This is called brute force attack. there is a data breach every few months it seems another huge company reports a hacking resulting in millions of people's account information being compromised 
This way, your account detail may get leaked, including password. One sentence I'll speak at the end of this video that must be kept in your mind. And that will be spoken by me at the end of this video. Next thing is there, choosing good password. Choosing effective password is very crucial and equally it is crucial to keep them confidential. Nobody should know about your password. The person may be your closest. Even then the password of your email and email accounts and Instagram accounts and Facebook accounts and other accounts as well. But that person should not be known to your password account because your friend and the person is close to you and sometimes suppose it happens that person may tell your password to anybody else and that person is not good then what will happen you know so the following points can help points can help you to choose the right password like no dictionary word proper nouns or foreign words not should be should not be used no personal information use longer password use paraphrases to remain remember complex password don't repeat password on different passwords use a combination of capital and small letters numbers and special characters the last one is the most important this is the last point that is the most important use a combination of capital and small letters numbers and special characters so this was all about Cyber safety and one more thing is I want to tell you one thing you always must remember that data or information which is online you have it is not hundred percent protected and safe it must be kept in your mind so that is why it is advised personally advised and personally suggested by me that don't keep your personal and valuable information over internet. 100% guarantee can't be given by any of the world IT professional that the 100% information is safe and protected. So thank you and have a nice day.